eyes and today we're going to be playing a little bit of snooker so yeah let's get into it so i'm just going to be showing you a couple of shots that went decently well this hopefully is a good shot but i did notice that i tried like not to get it in the pocket and i almost did but i'm quite i, I was glad i didn't and that set me up nicely for that red there which hopefully I can get him. It's like, I found it was, I thought it was really hard to do, but I still managed to do it. Oops, that's my recording time. It's one way to get him. And now I've got to try and get in a good colour. And I was, like, I was thinking, like, the brown was obviously the easiest, but, like, you're thinking just, like, oh, my God, what what am I going to do? Like, like it wasn't too hard, but now I'm going to go for my red, obviously. Um, this red weren't too hard, just for, like, smacking this one in. So that's what I did. Then I've got to get another red in. Apparently, this one I just put normally in, and then that black I was thinking of going for it, and like I was so tempted of going for that black, but like I knew it was gonna be hard to do. Oh, that is not nice. That is just terrible. Um, I remember I tried to get for like a double knock here, like just two hits in a row. One hit, two hit. It's a good one though. And if I wanted to, I could get that red once I put that black. And I did put the black, by the way. And it kind of gives me like a decent straight putt, in my opinion. And it kind of also set me up for the black to go again. Because the black's worth the most points, so the black's the best one to go for. Just gently knock it in. So that's like 50, I think that's like 23 points now. 22 points, can't count. This one I found particularly hard, but I still tried and got it in. So this one I just felt like I'd pelt it in, just because I could. Like, I tried to hit the hardest I could, so it went boom. And it would have just been amazing if I could have got that in, but I didn't. It's all fine, but it's just kind of like a wish. Oh, I wish I could have got that in, you know. Just, oh, I wish I could have been the King of England, a wish like that. And that would have been a brilliant pot if I could have got both of them in. But I've got, I've got to go for the black. The black's worth the most. And I went for quite a fast one here. Two in once. That is good. I'm sorry, Bill. I've never done a shot quite like that. I know the red was a fluke, but... Still good. And I put them in white. Not too good. Um, If I've got to get the... Red in, I've got to try and get a good angle. That's what I thought when I took the shot. This one I found quite hard. I, I, it was close, I'd say. Because I thought I'd miss it, but like obviously you just seen that it went in. And that yellow would be a nice one to get. But if I could, I could get the black. I've got to make sure you always keep the chalk on your um 
end of your queue, otherwise it don't work properly. That's going to be easy, straight down pot. And what a nice pot. I've got to somehow get to green them. I remember like the green I found was easy to see it's like so fast it like this. But like I it, like I would have found it a lot well, I, should, I felt like, watching it I, I felt like it's a lot harder to do. And like because when you feel it's like a lot harder to do you like oh my god it's so hard. But I just okay the brown has been potted. Um this is my video by the way I have done all these things. And so I'll get a blue in now. And then the blue I just felt like pelting it in. And so hopefully it'd land onto his pink, that's what I was thinking. But you can say you can be the judge if it did or not. I'd say it's okay. Like landing for the pink. See so that's like a gentle part in my opinion. Like just perfect. This is gonna, this was the final part of the game, and boom! See nothing on the board. I love that. <laughs>